What I'm about to tell you is going to blow your mind, so sit down first, don't want you keeling over. Okay, here we go. We're looking at negative 1 squared, all raised to the 3 halves power. You're probably thinking, let's just use that famous rule, a to the b, all to the c, is a to the b c product, right? So first approach, take minus 1, raise it to the product of the exponents, 2 times 3 halves, which gives you minus 1 to the third power, and that's minus 1. But step by step, negative 1 squared is 1, and then raising that 1 to the 3 halves power, take the square root of 1, then cube it, gives you 1. So, we got two different answers for the same thing. Wild, huh? How is that even possible? Here's the deal, that shortcut rule doesn't always work. In the real numbers, if the base is negative and one of your exponents has an even denominator, the whole thing breaks down. Pretty crazy, right? Let me know what you think in the comments below.